Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited to talk about what's in and what's out of style for fashion. It's my favorite time of the year and I just wanna share with you the most fashionable items that you're gonna be seeing a lot in 2023 and 2024. I did lots of research. I tried on lots of things to share with you the cutest stuff. So I'm super excited. So let's get into it. All right, so the first thing that is out of style that you do not want to wear are long tonics. I'm talking about those free people tonics that were super popular like a few years ago. Anything like that, like super oversized with leggings just isn't the vibe that we're going for this year. We're going for a cleaner aesthetic in 2023 and 24. So one of the most popular items that you're gonna see a lot this fall and winter are blazers. So I wanted to share like a super great blazer that fits everybody's price point. This is the most popular and best-selling blazer on Amazon. So I picked it up in red and I'm gonna tell you why later. It will make sense why I picked red, but this comes in tons and tons of colors and it fits so well. I'm wearing a size small, which is my normal size, but I will leave all my sizing in the description, but it has a little bit of an oversized fit to it, but it's still pretty tailored. It looks so good. There's like 25,000 reviews on on this blazer. So it's perfect for work, but it's also perfect for just like a sophisticated night out with like a really tight pair of leggings and some platform boots so you can dress it up, dress it down. So we are definitely going for a more classic vibe this fall and the blazer is going to be huge. What's out? The waterfall jacket is no longer in fashion and neither are ruffle like cardigans or ruffle jackets. That's just not something that we're wearing. <laughs> and as always, guys, this video is just sharing with you what you're gonna be seeing trending in stores. If there's something in this video that I'm saying that's out of style, but you love it, obviously keep rocking it. You do you, boo, okay? So instead of wearing these waterfall jackets, I suggest you try the sweater coat. Okay, so you know how shackets became super popular a couple years ago where you took a shirt and a jacket and we made a shacket. Well, this year we're taking a sweater and a coat and we're making a sweater coat. So this is the most comfy, beautiful coat ever. First of all, it looks super chic. Second of all, it is so soft and buttery. I found this one on Amazon, so affordable and it looks so high end and expensive. And I love that it's just that clean, classic vibe. This sweater coat comes in other colors. Obviously I love the white, but if white is not your thing, there are definitely darker colors. This is so, so, so gorgeous. It does have buttons, so it's like a double-breasted sweater coat, so you can definitely close it, but I kind of like the look of it open, but that's just my preference. This is so cozy. It is so, so good. What's out? Long cardigans are no longer in style. We're not doing it. We don't like the big, long, oversized cardigan. And instead, we are going to be doing the cropped cardigan. So basically the same thing, but in a shorter version. And I love the knit cardigans. So I found this one, just a classic black. It looks so cute open. You can also close it um, and button it. Now, I think that I bought this one in a little bit too big of a size. I size up because I normally like my cardigans and sweaters oversized, but for the crop cardigan, I wouldn't size up because um, you still want it to be a little more fitted. So get your true size so that it's more of a fitted look. Um, but I do like the crop cardigan closed or open. I think it's so chic, so classy. And you don't have to get it so cropped that you're showing skin. Like as you can see, like the way I'm wearing it, I'm wearing it with jeans and a bodysuit, so you're not seeing any skin. Um, and then the crop cardigan is still long enough that it is covering everything. Cause obviously if it's cold outside, like you don't want to be showing skin. So it's like more of like a mid crop. <laughs> Let's talk about a fashion trend that is in style this year. And that is the old money aesthetic. You can thank Sophia Ritchie for this one. She kind of like made this what it is today. Obviously this type of look has always been classic, but she really blew it up. And like everybody wants to kind of copy her style. And she totally like transformed her look from like the Kardashian look 
to like this old money vibe. And so I found a couple sweaters that definitely match this look. So the first is this asymmetrical sweater. It's definitely giving like old money, but very kind of like modernized with the asymmetrical vibe to it. This is super comfortable. It's oversized, but it looks very classy because of the shape and the dimension that this sweater gives. So this also comes in tons of colors and it's giving money, honey. The chunky knit cable sweaters are going to be all about this aesthetic as well. I found this one in gray. I love it. I like to do a little bit of a tuck with it, like the little French tuck, and then kind of have it over like spill on top of your jeans or your skirt. I think that looks good, but I'm gonna show you what it looks like when it's not tucked in. It's a little bit longer, but like a chunky knit is giving old money vibes. This is a classic type of sweater that will never go out of style. So this is like a good one to invest in. This one's affordable, but it's really well made. It's like nice and thick and cozy, comes in tons of colors, so cute. And then another very classic preppy old money vibe is the half zip pullover. So I found this one and what I love about this one is that it's textured, it has like a soft texture to it and textures are gonna be a really big thing that you see in fall and winter. So like anything ribbed, anything fuzzy, anything soft, anything with like some texture to it is gonna be super on trend. So this hits like two trends in one where it's like a teddy material, but it's also that classic old money vibe with just like a simple pullover. And this is just classic. So let's move in to my favorite fall fashion trend that I cannot stop wearing. And that is matching sets. So I have quite a few to show you. I cannot stop wearing these. If you ever see me in public, I'm either right now in a matching set or athleisure. And so I am just living for these matching sets. If there's one thing in this video that you have to buy, it is this matching set, okay? It is the joggers with this oversized sweater. I have put this on my fashion blog, which is christinabtv.com many times. And many of my blog readers have told me that they have bought this set and they absolutely love it. I have it in multiple colors. So you can kind of do all one color. So I have a gray one. Um, this was like at the airport and I'm wearing it and this comes in all gray but some of them have different colors. So I have a white one where it's white pants, but it has like this cream colored top. So I love this. You can also mix and match. You can wear them separate if you don't want to always wear them together. It is the softest, most comfortable thing, but also it's just super well made. I found it on Amazon. You would never in a million years think this came from Amazon. Amazon is so clutch lately. Like I'm finding such good stuff on there. They have elevated their game. I mean, like you are not gonna get better quality at a department store with this outfit. Like it is so good. Like this is my favorite thing in this video. So if there's anything you buy, you have to buy this set. It's already oversized. So I would not size up, just get your normal size. It's like an oversized comfortable fit. So if you prefer shorts, then this is a really comfy set. This is great for like lounging in your house, running errands, or just like heading outside when it's like not too cold out yet. It's actually pretty thick and warm. This has like a nice zip over pullover. It's comfortable. It's in a short set, comes in tons of colors. I just got like this camel color, um, but it's so, so cute. And it's so comfy, oversized fit, great for the airports or doing like errands. Okay, this brown set is one of my favorites right now. I love the color of it. It's like this chocolate brown. It's super oversized and comfy. It's not a sweater material. So this is great for my Southern girls. It's still super hot in Texas. So this is kind of what I'm wearing right now in fall, just like something that's lightweight. So this is very lightweight. So this will be good for wearing now before it gets too cold. I love it. It's like this gauzy material, super, super chic looking though. Pair it with like a designer bag or a, des or a bag that looks like fashionable and it just so elevates the look. I love this one. And another fan favorite and one of my personal favorites are these textured ones. So I have this olive green one, which is perfect for fall. Green is such a good color for fall. These textured 
matching sets. I kid you not, I have like four pairs of these. I have a pink one for spring and I had like a bright green one for summer and now I have this olive green one for fall. I just love it. It is so cute. Again, perfect for wearing right now when it's still warm outside. Great, like you need it. It's so good. What's out? open toed boots are out. Thank goodness, because they're so impractical, okay? We are not going to be wearing these this year. And instead, what is in are like the chunky Chelsea boots, chunky platform shoes. So I just wanted to highlight one of my favorite pairs that I have been wearing for the last like year and a half. And this is these Jeffrey Campbell um, Chelsea boots. When I was being, when I was a travel nurse in Cleveland, I took these with me. They got me through the crazy storms up north in Cleveland. They're so comfy. I got so many compliments in Cleveland when I would wear them. And they also just like work really well if it's not snowing too, like in water, rain, snow, everything. It's one of those boots you can really wear in any kind of climate and they're super comfortable. What's in? Textured tops and sweaters. So I kind of touched on this earlier in the video about texture, anything like ribbed or anything soft and fuzzy, like all those textures are really popular in fall right now and going into winter. So I wanted to highlight this top. Oh my God, you guys. Oh my God, this top is so gorgeous. So it's super textured. This looks like a very expensive designer who I shall not name, but there is a designer out there that makes tops like this that go for like over $300. I bought this on Amazon, super cheap. It looks expensive. It feels expensive. It literally, the girls are girling. So if you want your girls to like look really, really good, if that is like one of your goals, or like maybe you are smaller chested and you want your chest to appear bigger, you need this top because it literally looks so good. It's something about the way, like the texture of it, the way the shape of the lines, it's enhancing the girls, okay? So you need this top if that's what you want to do. I love it in this green color, but it comes in other colors as well. This top is just like so designer inspired. I love it. What's in faux leather? Yes, I am so here for this trend. It's one of my favorites. I've been wearing like faux leather dresses now while it's still warm, but you can easily transition to this when it gets really cold with some tights or like a really cool jacket, like the sweater coat that I showed earlier would look so good with these. But I have it in this like eggplant color and this would be perfect if you like dark colors, but I also love a little faux leather white. So I actually have this dress in two colors, same dress. I love it that much. And then I have a longer version of a faux leather dress. This one is so classy. It's also giving that old money aesthetic that we talked about. So this just like hits all the points for me. I love it. And then skirts are going to also be really big for fall. So I have been wearing this faux leather skirt in like a lot of footage I've been showing you with a lot of the tops and sweaters. I love it. It's just like a faux leather white skirt. So comfortable. I think skirts are so much more comfortable than skirts because it has the shorts attached in so you feel a little more comfortable. Okay, and then I want to highlight on some color schemes you're going to see a lot of. So a pop of red is going to be very popular this fall. So just like a pop, like kind of like that red blazer I showed you at the beginning of the video, wear a red blazer with like all black or some white or some gray, or even just do like a red pop with a scarf. You could do a red pop with a handbag, a red pop with just your shoes. Just a little bit of red is going to go a long way this fall. So another it color for fall is going to be like that dark olivey green. So when you're picking up sweaters, for your new fall wardrobe, you can definitely like lean towards those like olives and those forest greens. Those are definitely going to be in style this year. Leave me a comment below and let me know which fall trend was your favorite. Which one are you going for? And let's have a discussion in the comments and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.